all right good morning guys so it is now wednesday this week is honestly going so fast this past two weeks has gone super fast i was going to go and edit my vlog because i never got around to editing it yesterday i had to film something and then we had to go out um i was started a new job yesterday so we had to go out and get a few things for his new job um so yeah um so yeah i ended up putting the footage on my cat on my what was it my computer wow um i ended up putting the footage on my computer yesterday and then i went to go edit it before and i realized it's last week's footage and i hadn't even put last week's vlog up like what i completely forgot um so yeah i've got i'm gonna scrap that vlog <laughs> and put up last week's vlog so uh not last week the week before is the vlog that i forgot to put up but we've got last week's vlog so i'm gonna put that up today um and then we'll have another one on I think Monday we'll have this week's weekly vlog and then we'll be getting into vlogmas which hopefully fingers crossed I'll upload every day again not gonna promise but um yeah I always say not gonna promise when I do vlogmas because there's always a couple of days that I miss but I'm kind of hoping fingers crossed that I will do every day I'll have something for every day to upload but yeah anyway back to my main story I completely forgot to upload vlog from two weeks ago so now we're uploading last week's vlog i've just put the footage onto my computer and i'll do that in archie's next break i mean archie's next nap he's just down here he's just woken up he's got a car in his mouth at the moment don't eat that car he's currently making a mess in his little play area he loves this teddy he tries and climbs tries to climb all over it but yeah i've just been um watching or uh, tidying up the house um doing a few things around the house and then yeah he pretty much woke up i had some breakfast i need to fold that washing over there so i think i'm gonna do that i bought this yesterday we, had to, we went to kmart so uh, i brought this yesterday and i'm gonna use it as like a dump basket um just to put everything that doesn't belong in the lounge in there and then like at the end of the day I can take it around to where everything is supposed to be um, and put it all away. I figured it would just make life easier. And he had a couple of an accident a couple of days ago. He got a little bruise on his head. We were playing on the tiles. Like I was sitting right next to him but it happened so fast. I felt absolutely awful but we were playing around. He was chasing a block and I think he just like missed where he'd put his hand and then he banged his head on the tiles. So we're not going to play on the tiles anymore. We're going to play in your play area or on the mat. Okay? Hi. <laughs> hey, cute boy. I also want to go through his toys at some stage. Um, and go through, like, the toys that he doesn't really use anymore. Like, all of his real... Hold on. <laughs> We're not going anywhere. Yeah, go through his, like, baby, baby toys that he used when he was, like, a... That we got him when he was like a newborn and stuff i just want to either put them away or donate them um because i want to get him a lot of new toys for christmas so yeah we're just going to go through his other ones a lot of his other toys are like like just like the things that we used to put on his little um like you'd attach them to the little arches for his um play mats and stuff like that and he just doesn't really use them anymore so i thought i would give them away to babies who need them all right, so I've just decided to try Archie on having some milk out of his sippy cup. He hasn't had milk out of this yet, but he has had water. And it usually goes down all right. Like, he doesn't... We still give it to him in a different sippy cup, like water in a different sippy cup that we, like, have to tip up for him. But I wanted to try giving him his milk in this to see if he'd drink it more. He didn't have any milk before he went to sleep before. He kind of just started to fall asleep on me. We were watching The Grinch and he fell asleep on my shoulder. So um, he didn't drink any milk. We need to wipe your face, dude. Where's your bib? Um, so yeah, I thought I would try and give him some in a sippy cup while he's watching a bit of TV to see how he would go. Um, and he seems to be doing all right. Um, he knows how to suck out of it. It's just he prefers to bite it. So you yeah, will see how long he drinks this for but I only made him I made him 150 mils He will usually have a 200 ml bottle. Sometimes he won't finish it though So I've just put 150 in there and see how he goes with it. So I'll give him this. This will be his 
Just the second bottle of the day. Um, he honestly doesn't drink that much anymore because he does eat food. I know like formula is supposed to be his main source and it probably still is, but he just loves food. So, oh yeah, he still hits about three to four bottles a day, depending, but um, you need to drink from the other end, dude. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm just gonna leave him with this for a while and see how he goes. Yeah, do you like it? Is it nice? Yum? Um, Do you like feeding yourself? Um, he doesn't quite understand with a normal bottle how to like lift it up. Um, so, and like pull up the bottle. So I have to give it to him and this, otherwise it'll just go everywhere. Yeah. Do you like it? <laughs> you drink it. You gotta drink it. All right, I'm gonna go help him. Need some help? <laughs> <laughs> all right so it is now friday it's blank friday today i'm just about to head off i'm gonna go to the mall to go check out kmart um there is some things i want to grab that were in like the bright they're like black friday sales they call it bright friday um that I want to see if they've got there because they sold out online. Um, and where are my sunglasses? I hate it when Ollie uses my car because, like, he just I don't know what he does to it. It's just like, and it's so hot. Oh my god. Holy moly. Oh my god, where are my sunglasses? Ugh, I don't know where my other sunglasses are gone, but these are going to have to do. Um, yeah, I'm just off to Kmart. It's so hot. Yeah, because there's some books that I wanted to get from there. Um, they sold out online. I literally went on at like 4 o'clock this morning and they were already sold out. So people must have got them on there super early. Um, yeah, I just want to go have a look around as well. I've been wanting to go to Kmart for ages. Um, just without Archie, um, well, I always go with Archie, but like, that sounds really mean. I've been wanting to go to Kmart, like, just by myself for a while because I'll take Archie, but like, I keep him in the pram. He's always asleep when we go to Kmart. I don't know what it is. Did I? Fuck. Did I close the friggin'? Yeah. Um. Yeah, he always, like, falls asleep in his pram whenever I take him out and, like, Go shopping so I just want to go by myself today I also have some long time I haven't been by myself for like nearly like two weeks now I've been like in the house and I'm going a little bit crazy so yeah I'm gonna get out um, just on my own for a little bit um, and yeah see what they have it came out I also want to do a little bit of Christmas shopping as well I want to um, there's something that I've seen it came up they brought out with the black, um, the Bright Friday sale that I want to see if they still have to in store. Alright, so I'm back home now. I'm just currently testing out some new lighting that I bought this afternoon. The, this is the, I'm currently using the ring light. Hold on, let me turn my hair up and I'll show you guys. Alright, so, um, Kmart wasn't so successful. I didn't find what I wanted. I did get a couple of things that I wanted, but there was like these books, the um, like the catwalk books. The there was Louis Vuitton, YSL, and a Chanel one, um, that I really wanted to get, and they sold out online this morning so early, and I didn't get them in store. Um, so yeah, but I found a couple of other things. I picked up this lighting that I'm using at the moment. It's this here. This is the Studio Selfie Light Stand. It's actually so good. It was only $15. Like, what? Um, came out, have another ring light, not this one, um, that I had been looking for for the longest time. My hair is doing something super weird. Um, yeah, they had this other one that I had been looking for for the longest time, but, um, yeah, they didn't... They haven't had it for ages, so I just never got it. And I think I showed you guys a couple of weeks ago another light that I got, but... It's just too small like the light itself is probably about that big 
Rinse and I'll show you guys. So this is it here. Um, and it's actually a really good light. Like it's super bright. Let me turn it on for you guys. I think I, I need to do the batteries. But it's super light. But you can see it only lights up a certain bit of my face. And it puts it too much into one area. Whereas this light lights up everything. And I just love it. Um, so yeah, I'm still going to keep this. Because I might use it as backlighting. We'll see. Um, but yeah, it will come in handy. I just... I don't know, it's just, where's the back of it gone? What? Oh, it's in there. Um, but yeah, I'll still use it. It's just a shame because it was like $150. And when you spend $15 on a light, that is working amazing. And this one here didn't do it for you. It's a little bit disappointing. I do like this though. It's not like a bad one. It's just, this is better and it was only $15. So, yeah. Um. Anyway. Yeah, I got that light. Let me show you some of the settings. So I like as well that this is not battery operated. This is a, um, this is like a little mini review. Um, but yeah, it comes with three light modes. Let me show you guys. So you've got this one here. I think this is natural. Um, and then you've also got warm, which is that I will probably never use warm unless I'm taking a photo or something like that. And I want like that glow look, you know. Um, and then there's the cool one, which I thought I was going to use, but it's just a little bit blue. And then there's the natural, which I personally love. This is my favorite. Um, and you can turn it up and down. I've currently got it on the brightest setting, but you can keep lowering it. So that is the lowest it goes. Um, and I'll show you with the off. That's with the off. So yeah, it's a really good ring light. I'm super happy with it. Let's turn it right back up. I like it bright. Um, but yeah, what it, you just plug it into like any USB cord, like your iPhone charger or something like that. Um, and yeah, it works. I like that because that way it's not going to like dim the light. I found with the other one because it was battery operated, um, it dimmed the light really, really, um, fast. The light dimmed on it really fast. Like I couldn't get through a video without it dimming. So yeah, that was kind of annoying as well. So this one's going to be good for when I film video but it also comes with this which is a phone adapter let me grab this thing here so this little thing here you can plug your iphone into onto it or any phone i think um i probably won't use it for a phone just because i don't use my phone and if i am going to use it i'm just going to hold it probably actually i probably could use it I'm, i'll keep it but um yeah i don't use these sort of things very often but i will keep it in with all my bits and bobs for my lighting so yeah so so happy with that only $15 and look at this that's amazing what is my setting on actually so it's on I turn the exposure up by 0 0.3 this is it on no like just auto like normal um but I like it a little bit brighter so I do turn it up but yeah this light is incredible for $15 um, so if this isn't something you came out and you like to like have good lighting when you're doing your makeup or you film videos as well, go pick this up. On. It's amazing. Um, let me show you what else I got from Kama. So I'm not going to show you everything that I got because I have got some stuff for Archie in here. It's Christmas presents. Obviously, he's not going to watch my videos and think, oh, that's my Christmas present. But um, I do kind of want to do a separate video, like a what I got for my son for Christmas videos so i'm not going to show you guys those yet but yeah i picked up a couple of things for him from there um but anyway i picked up a few things for myself as well i got some bright things boot things so i picked up some nipple covers this is just for when i don't want to wear a bra which is like all the time but let's be real i can't get away with it um but uh, yeah, for when I don't want to wear a bra, I bought some nipple covers because I don't have any. I've only got like the stick on bra and it's annoying. So um, I got those. I also picked up some hook extenders. My bras are a little bit tight. Um, I really need to go get fitted for a bra properly. I haven't been fitted in years and I always just kind of wing it with bras. But I actually think like I need to go get, go to a place and get them properly fitted because yeah, like... I'm just going through so many bras that I'm, I'm currently holding my boobs, yes, but I'm just going through so many bras that I'm not liking that I just need to go to somebody and get them to fit bras to me. So yeah, um, 
I picked up some of these though. These are toe hook bra extenders. Um, so yeah, you just put those on if your bra is feeling a little bit uncomfortable or tight. Um, and then I also got this. I really like Kmart bras and these bras in particular. I couldn't find this particular one for the longest time. This is the, um, I think it's just called the t-shirt bra. Um, and I just really like these because they're super comfortable. They don't push, push my boobs up to my chin. Um, and yeah, I don't like, I used to love push-up bras when I was younger, but now I'm like, I don't want that. I don't want my tits pushed right up to my chin. So yeah, I just got a nice t-shirt bra and I just love the way my boobs look underneath like a plain top in that particular bra. So I picked that up. I've just been like trying sizes out because the sizing is so weird for me now. I used to be like... A 10B, 10C, and now my boobs have just like, like my whole body's completely changed after having a baby, which I expected, but like I just don't think it'd be that hard to find a bra for myself. <laughs> um, exactly where I need to go get fitted. But I also picked up some jeans, love Kmart jeans. Um, these are the skinny, extra high rise, ankle length sculpting jeans. I'm hoping these are the right size. Last time I picked up a pair of skinny jeans from there, they were the wrong size. Ooh, these have that nice like bum shaped thing. And my camera is, hold on, give me a sec. I just need to clear some room. That's better. Um, but, but these have the really nice shaping bit on the bum. So I'm gonna try these on tomorrow and see how they go. Um, and then I also just picked up a plain t-shirt as well. I really like t-shirts. Okay, so I'm wearing like a singlet right now that like comes down, but I really like tops that like come up to just here and I feel like this one is going to do that um so I just picked up one of these and I'm actually going to cut it into a crop because most of my jeans are high-waisted so um yeah I think this was like four dollars or something like that so I'm just going to cut this into a crop so that like it fits better with my jeans otherwise like I don't know what to do with the extra like bit that doesn't go anywhere like has to tuck under my jeans and gives me a big bulge um so yeah I'm going to cut that one into a crop probably tomorrow um but yeah i just find with longer tops especially because i have got a really really short torso um crop tops seem to look better with my jeans um so yeah i am gonna change that one and yeah that's what i got from kmart um i was really going for christmas presents and those books so yeah most of the things i did get were presents mainly for archie um so I'm going to go play around with my lights some more. I'm so happy with this. I've been looking for just some good lighting to give me like a little bit of light instead of opening the window there because then it gives me all kinds of shadows. So now I can sit in my room and I want to film at night as well. Like once Archie's gone down, it's so much easier to film when he's asleep. Like I can film when he's awake, that's fine. But it's just like I like to give him the attention when he's awake. So yeah, filming at night is easier in this like gives me good light yay oh by the way i did get my nose pierced i didn't tell you guys in the last vlog because i skipped a vlog um of me actually getting my nose pierced i didn't show you guys but i told you guys i was getting my nose pierced but yeah i got my nose pierced um not last week but the week before yeah i love it i miss i've had my nose pierced like twice now this is the third time getting it done so yeah i was used to i'm used to it but I just felt like having, look at it, it's so different, but I love it, yay, um, but yeah, I just wanted to have a nose, my nose ring bag, this is a little bit bigger than I'd like, um, but obviously when, once it's healed, um, I will get a proper, either a ring, I love rings, um, or I'll get a, um, what do you call it, like a smaller stud. Anyway, I'm gonna go and put this stuff away and then I might go into bed, go jump into bed and watch some friends and just relax. It's Friday evening tonight. Um, came out was my big thing to do for Friday night, so that's what we've done. And yeah, I'm just getting really tired now. I was up at four o'clock this morning, so I'm not surprised that I'm getting tired. All right, hello guys. So it is now Saturday um, and I am just making Archie's lunch. I also have a YouTube video on, which is very loud. Archie's down here making a mess. Dude, what are you doing? 
Can okay, mommy have this one? Ta. I'm here making this. I'm gonna eat that mango later on. And yeah, I'm just making his lunch at the moment. He's gonna have some rice. And then I also am cutting up some peaches for him. I wasn't too sure about giving him like canned peaches, but he seems to love them. So um, yeah, he's having some of these. Um, and then he's also gonna have a little bit of cheese as well. But yeah, anyway, today, not getting up to much. Ola's gone out for the day. Um, so me and Arla, I mean Archie are just Chilling out at home. I was going to go out. We were going to go. I need to get him a new mattress for his bed because I just don't think it's very comfortable. He's been coming into our room at about 4 o'clock while ella has been bringing him into our room. Um, but, yeah, he hasn't been sleeping very well lately. So, I think he needs a new mattress because he loves our mattress. And our mattress has kind of got, like, padding. We got him the mattress that was from Ikea. Um, but I think it's just a little bit too hard for him now. So I really want to go get him another mattress. But um, I just don't know if I'm going to be able to fit it in the car with him also in it. So I might have to do it um, when Ella's at home. So I need to go to baby bunting. Um, I could possibly squeeze it in. But I'll also have like the pram in there and stuff. And it's just yeah, not going to be a comfortable ride. So yeah, I think we'll just wait for that. Um, and have a nice chill day at home. It's quite warm, to, like it's warm today, but it's also windy. I was gonna um, fill the pool, fill the pool up, um, but yeah, it is a little bit windy, and I need to use the. Oh, it's actually stopped being windy now. I need to use the. Um, oh, that's a lot of pictures. I need to use the um, compressor, and I don't really know how to use the compressor, so. Maybe that'll be another day, maybe tomorrow. But yeah, I really wanted to go to the beach today, but I just don't know where one is around me. And like, I'm comfortable driving, but we're in a new-ish area and I haven't really driven like too far away from where we live. Um, so I'm just a little bit like worried about where I drive at the moment. Just kind of freak out a little bit, but um, yeah. All right, I'm gonna let that cool for a bit, but I'm so excited. We got Archie's big Christmas present last night. We ordered it online, um, and I'm so excited for it to arrive. Obviously, he won't be getting it until Christmas, but. Yeah, I'm so excited for it to like, get here. We've wanted to buy this for him like since before he was even born, so yeah. I'm very excited for it. You guys will see it on Christmas. I'm not going to show it in a vlog or anything like that just yet. But I want to do like a video where I show you guys. I think I said this yesterday. I want to do a video where I show you guys what I buy him for Christmas. So yeah, he's got his big present coming tomorrow. Actually, we could go to the mall. I need to go to Target. So maybe we'll go to the mall today. Um, I've been trying to get his christmas shopping done um because i don't want to leave it to last minute so i've been trying to pick up things here and there there's a few things that i want to grab him from target so maybe i'll go do that today i kind of wanted to do it with ola but if i wait for ola i'll be waiting forever so i think i'll just do it today maybe after his lunch oh my god it is so freaking hot all right i've just got an archie in the car and we are about to head off we're gonna go to um i need to go to chemist warehouse and i want to go to a bigger one um that's not like the one that's near our house but like a little bit further away so we're gonna head to that one um and there's a tk max there as well so i might just jump into that tk max last time i went there they had some really good stuff so yeah we're just gonna get out of the house i feel like i just need to get out of the house like i went out yesterday but i just feel like it wasn't for like long enough so um yeah it's a really beautiful day it's super hot i wanted to go for a walk like at this really nice beach sort of area but it's just far too hot to go for a walk so I think we'll go have a look at a couple of shots I've got shots I've got the aircon blasting because it is so freaking hot but yeah anyway we are about to head off I think I've got everything you honestly need to pack so much stuff when you take a baby out I always like have to triple check my bag before I go out to make sure I've got everything um, but I think I've got everything there's a stroller in the back 
Yep, that's in the back. All right, let's go. I'm running out of battery on this. I'm running out of battery on my phone. We'll see how we go. All right, so I have just gotten back home, but I'm going to sit in the car for a bit because Archie's fallen asleep. Um, and I've also got some food, so I think I'm just going to eat that in here while he sleeps um, instead of waking him up because I've woken him up already today, like getting him out of the car to go. Um, so I'm not going to wake him up again, but we picked up a couple of things today. I got some gifts for Ella, I got some gifts for Archie. Did I get anything for Archie? No, oh, I think I just got like like a little top or something for him, but I'm gonna, probably going to give that to him now anyway. So yeah, but anyway, I've got some Mexican food. This is my favorite Mexican food place. This is Jasmine and Gomez, um, but I got some tacos and queso fries because that's just like the best thing there. Um, I need to turn the car so. I literally have to keep the car running because we need the aircon in here, it's so freaking hot. Yeah, anyway, I'm gonna go eat my food. I'm gonna show you guys. So this is what I got. I got some um, three chicken tacos. I used to get the $3 tacos, which are also really good, but the chicken is extra good. And then I also got queso fries. These are amazing. If you haven't tried queso from Guzman and Gomez and you have one near you, try it. It is freaking amazing. Anyway, I'm gonna go and eat this. I'm so hungry. Alright, so it is now a little bit later on in the evening. I've just had a shower and gotten myself ready for bed. Um, but I have been organising our bedroom, basically. We're not organising it, but just cleaning it up. We need a really big clean up. We actually moved this out of the, well, Ella did, moved it out of the wardrobe this morning so yeah we had a gecko in our room last night and we don't know where it's gone we locked it in the um wardrobe while we went back to sleep and then we woke up and we couldn't find him we still don't know where he is i've changed like all of my clothes around so like surely he would have fallen out um but yeah we still haven't found him yet i'll have took everything out this morning hence why i needed to clean the room um but yeah, we just have a friend in our room with us. We don't know where he is. That's okay. Um, but did you win a level? Yeah, I got it. <laughs> yeah, we had like washing all over the floor, just crap everywhere. We do. I do need to vacuum, but I'll do that tomorrow when Archie's awake. Because um, otherwise he will probably wake up. He doesn't like the vacuum cleaner. But yeah, um, I organized my wardrobe as well. So um, I ended up just moving some of my clothes around to make more sense so basically on the side I've got all of my like tops and jumpers and stuff so we go from like crop tops to tops to shirts to jumpers and then I've put all my pants on this side and then also like my more I guess going out not going out clothes but like nicer clothes that I would wear out because we don't go out very much at all um, even though we can where we live um we don't really tend to so i've just put all of like things that i tend to wear more often toward the front and then also right in the back i've got some clothes that need to go that i'm gonna get rid of so um yeah but it's nice and organized and how i like it makes sense in my head for when i'm picking an outfit something to wear for the day it just makes sense in my head so yeah but um Nice and clean. Anyway, I thought I would show you guys what I got from TK Maxx today. I got a few other things that aren't in the bag, but I won't show you those because they're actually Ella's Christmas presents. Well, this, yeah, Christmas presents that I bought today. So I'm not going to show those, but I will show you the other things that I got. So the first thing I picked up is this little photo frame here. I thought this was so cute. I'm actually going to put a photo of me and Ella in here. And then I'm going to put it up on this set of drawers here. I need to like make that nice and pretty on the top. Um, but we'll do that tomorrow. I um, can't be bothered tonight. Um, yeah, so I'm going to put a nice photo on that. Let me just delete some footage. 
And then next I picked up a cleanser and this is from The Grown Alchemist. I've actually been looking for this for quite a while. It's a cream cleanser. I know I had seen it at TK Maxx before but they run out of the one that they've they had run out of it at the one that I usually go to so I found one more today in the store that I went to today. I went to a different one. Um, and yeah, I'm really excited to try this out. I love all the Grown Alchemist products that I've got at the moment. I think I've only tried the hand wash and the body lotion, but yeah, I love them. So I wanted to try out the cleanser and just the packaging is so, like the aesthetic of it is really nice. All right, so next I picked up some Burt's Bees lip balms i love burt's bees lip balms and they had some limited edition christmas ones so i got this one here which is salted caramel this smells like the glass house taha candle um it smells amazing i love it and then we've also got the peppermint one as well and this smells just like a candy cane both so good they also had um a vanilla maple one and also a um spiced chai chai tea one um that i was looking at but i thought these two sounded the best so i picked those up i got this here hi pepper i got this here this is um from a brand called artista gourmet it's the skinny chocolate syrup it's more like a liquid i wouldn't say that it's like a syrup um looks like a bottle of wine but I wanted this to put into my coffee it's got no calories and no sugar um i don't know what else is in it but um i thought this would be nice to add to my coffees currently i just add collagen and drink it black but i want to try this out i got this here for our spare bathroom this is um, a hand and soap lotion set from Body Prescriptions in Peppermint. I smelt the um, lotion and the lotion smelt amazing. So yeah, and the hand wash also smells amazing as well. The hand wash has a little bit more of like a citrus scent to it. Whereas the body, uh, the hand lotion actually smells like peppermint. But yeah, I just thought that was super cute for Christmas and it's in this cute little wooden tray as well. And then I got a little um, onesie for Archie. It's just a Hurley onesie. Um, and I thought this was super cute. I was actually got a white t-shirt just like this. Like it looks exactly the same. So I thought that it'd be cute to get them a little matchy matchy one. And then the last thing I picked up were some cards. And these are Friends cards. I love Friends. Me and Ola are currently watching it at the moment. Yeah again <laughs> we've watched it once already since it came out on netflix in australia um but obviously we had seen it on tv before but we're watching it again so i thought i'd pick up the cards i swear cards is something that we never have mm. like we always buy them but then when we actually want them we never have them so yeah there's two set sets of cards in here this would make a really good gift idea for somebody who's into like cards or just like anyone in general cards are always good to have in the house um but yeah they've got that on the back so there's that set and there's also this set it's got who is that that is ross and chandler and then she's got the friends on the back so yeah love that but that is what i got from tk maxx today that is what i got from tk maxx tk maxx was so packed today i went to a different one than I usually go to and it was yeah just so packed I think because there's a lot in the store and there were just a lot of people in the store it was a little bit crazy um the one I go to usually near my house is a little bit like bigger and spaced out so yeah. anyway I am going to go and jump into bed getting a little bit tired now after all my cleaning but yeah, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. I actually thought there was a girl. Uh, she is. The last, like, I feel like for the last week, she's usually been out at night. We try not to let her out at night because, I don't know. 
We just don't like it being here. Yeah, there's like spiders, spiders snakes, all sorts. She's turned into um, a wildcat. But we let her out a couple of times during the day. She usually wants to come back inside though because it's super hot. Um, but yeah, she's actually like, she actually wants to be inside tonight. So yeah. Hey, give me all the cuddles. It's so much nicer inside than outside, right? Yeah, I'm gonna go and jump into bed now. I will talk to you guys tomorrow. I actually thought this was not, I actually thought we were gonna have another vlog before Vlogmas, but, but we're not. It's literally December on, is it Monday or Tuesday? I think it's Monday, Tuesday. No, I'm pretty sure the first of December is on Monday. So this is like the last weekly vlog. What? It's crazy. Anyway, I'm gonna go, I will talk to you guys tomorrow morning sleep in my eye mm. hey guys all right wow look at me i'm so red it's so hot today i've refused to get like changed and ready today because it's just so damn hot um and i'm doing a lot of like moving furniture and stuff around today so i'm not going to get ready for the day maybe like later on in the afternoon i've just put archie down for his nap Winnie the Pooh is going strong. We can turn that down now. But yeah, I am doing a little bit of rearranging today. It's Monday, by the way. I thought I'd just continue vlogging today since um, we start Vlogmas tomorrow. But yeah, I will upload this vlog today, later on in the afternoon. But I'm just moving a bunch of things around. I'll show you guys once it's all done. But I actually put the couch back where we originally had it when we first moved in here. So this is our lounge. That's where the windows are. And then... Um, I put the couch facing this way and then it's just me sitting on it's very hard to see and then I put the TV there I just think it looks better Ola didn't want to do this because it cuts off that section but we really don't use that section the only thing we use it for is to put like actually stuff like his playpen and then um his pram and stuff like that and then all his chairs so there's really no this space has no function at the moment I do want to get a um dining table I've been saying that for ages but I couldn't find the right one and now I found one that I think would be perfect for that space so um yeah we don't they don't have any in store until January so um we're just gonna wait until then but yeah I'm gonna put Archie's play area back over here um just so that he's still able to get into the lounge also he has his little car that's another reason Ola didn't want to put it this way is because um he thought he wasn't going to be able to get his car but I think he'll still be able to get his little car in through here so he can come and see us and have a look outside. Um, but yeah, I'm going to, I'm glad I've just put Archie down actually because I need to clean his play mat. So I'm going to get some spray and stuff on that. And then I'm going to set up the Christmas tree. Um, after I've done that, I'm just going to put the tree and the lights up today. I'm not going to decorate it. I want to wait until like Archie and Ola are both here to do that or at least Ola. Um, Ola doesn't finish work till like 5.30 and doesn't get home till about 6.30. So, um, yeah, Archie might not even be away. I don't know. But yeah, I do want to wait for us all to decorate the tree. So I'm just going to put the tree up today so that it's up and it's a little bit festive and then I'm hoping tomorrow we'll decorate it so that um, I really wanted to like decorate the tree for the first day of Vlogmas. Yeah, Pippa's outside here. Come on, do you want to come inside? Please don't jump over everything though and knock everything over because that's what you were doing before and that's why I put you outside. Come on. Come on. Are you going to play around? Okay. What are you looking at? Um... But yeah, I've made an absolute mess, so I really need to go and start tidying all all up and putting everything in place. But I just like this layout much better. Um, I get sick of things so easily, like the way my house is laid out. I get sick of it so easily, so it'll probably change in a couple of months. I don't know. Um, but yeah, if I sit down for too long, I'm going to stay sitting down, so I'm actually going to get up and continue organizing the lounge what else are we doing today i have to edit this vlog i'm probably going to do that after i've done the lounge um because i need to get this up today because i don't want to have it up tomorrow and then we've got vlogmas so yeah that needs to be done today sorry i was like bunting my hand right at the moment um and then what else are we doing today i've just got to do some more really need to tidy up the kitchen look at the kitchen i've absolutely ruined it um and then yeah pretty much just chill i've popped on a pop up load of washing 
um and yeah just hang out with archie really it's perfect but anyway oh, i'm also so excited as well because i love puzzles i love doing puzzles like especially at night just relaxing and doing puzzles i'd rather do a puzzle than watch tv um so i've got my little puzzle things down here but what i want to do is we're now going to have enough space for a little bar stool here we've got a bar stool outside um so i'm actually going to bring it in here and i'm gonna like i bought this little mat don't mind the dirty floor i'm cleaning it um i bought this mat so you can actually roll your puzzle up and it doesn't get ruined um so yeah i'm gonna lay that out here at night so i can still do my puzzle on a surface i was doing it on the floor but i've had a really 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 sore back lately so i can't do that anymore but yeah anyway i'm gonna go i've still got energy so i'm gonna go get this lounge done i'm ready Alright, so the tree is now up. I put the lights on as well. I think it looks so cute. I kind of want to leave it like this, but we have so many decorations that we actually just need to decorate it. But um, yeah, I put my little lantern down there as well, but I want to get something bigger just to cover the cords there because it just looks not so great. Um, but yeah, love it so far. I put my tree skirt on as well. Wish my tree skirt was a little bit bigger in all honesty. I thought it was going to be like wider. Um, but that's okay but that's what we have so far and we will decorate it later on probably tomorrow so i'm just going to chuck all the christmas decorations under there for now and then um yeah we'll decorate it properly tomorrow it's on a little bit of a lean which is really frustrating but i think i've done it so that it doesn't look like on it's it's on too much of a lean if i have it facing this way so yeah i've got to spread apart a couple of the bushes as well but um yeah i'm super happy with how it looks originally i wanted to get the tree that had all of the little pine looking things um but they were out of stock but this one here looks cute too it's kind of like a bluey sort of shade as well super pretty i love these little bell lights too they're so cute i wasn't sure how i was gonna like these but i love them they're really cute but that's my tree our tree <laughs> Also, does anyone know how to keep the cats out of the tree? My cat loves to get all up in the tree and climb it, and I don't want her to do that. So does anyone have any tricks to stop that? And same with babies as well. I know Archie, when he's on his car, is going to want to go crazy over this tree. Um, and I don't blame him. I mean, I probably would too if I was a baby and just saw this. I'd be like, wow, I want to grab that. But I know when he's on his car, he's going to want to grab the tree. So also mums out there, how do you stop your baby from grabbing at the tree? Tell me some tricks. But yeah, anyway, I'm going to go pop all the decorations away. Put this box in the garage and then Archie's not up yet. If I have enough time, oh, I need to do his play area too. We'll do that next actually. What's that? Is that the Christmas tree? <laughs> what is it? Is that pretty? What is that? 
there. Oh, this is your stocking. Oh, is it that cheese? It is. It's a tree. What do you think? <laughs> Can I touch it? Touch it. Well, that's good, you don't want to touch it. Yeah, have a look. What is that? Oh my goodness. Is that a Christmas tree? It's your first Christmas tree. Wow, look. Look at that, it's pretty, yeah? All right guys, so my lounge is done and I am loving how it looks. It just looks so cozy and homely and I'm so happy with it. All right, so I'll give you a little tour. Don't mind the food on the floor. Archie's having his lunch and I'm gonna do what I can while I can. Right, you just like to chuck it all on the floor. Um, but yeah, when you come through the lounge, we've got like his little play area. I bought this a wee while ago. I thought I was going to return it because it was too small, but um, I actually don't mind it how it is here in his play area set up. I switched his um, foam pad underneath around to the grey side. I just like the grey aesthetic, okay? It just looks better with the lounge. And he doesn't care whether it's a green one or a grey one. So all he cares about is the books, the toys what is in the area so yeah i put his toy area here this is just like my chuckle basket of anything that doesn't belong in here and i need to put away um and then coming along here we're watching a bit of Paige corin i've just had like so many youtube videos on in the background this morning um and i'm getting so excited for christmas so i've put up my little um family ornament a candle that's an ikoya candle little crystal and then I love this I actually bought this over from New no this one I actually bought in Sydney um, at our last house um, but it's just a little caravan I think it's so cute um, and then coming along here I just gotta fix the photo up to Papa knocked it down I actually want to get a couple of my other decoration books and put them there so I'll do that eventually um, and then I have my glass tree here that I got from Kmart a little red heart you guys I have had this for years now probably like five or six years i would say maybe longer um it's actually from one of my friends in new zealand um and i brought it over to australia with me just love it it's cute um and then i've got the little nutcracker here this is archie's first snow globe um i'm gonna buy him a new snow globe each year i've decided it also plays music as well i kind of want to put that in his room but like i do need to organize his room too it's getting a bit messy so yeah it's out here for now and then I decided to put the baubles um, that I was supposed to return to Target, but I can't find the receipt anymore, so looks like they're going to stay. Um, but I've decided to use those to cover the um, cords for now. And then I've also got my little gnome Santa guy. We bought him last year, I think. Um, and yeah, we whipped him out again. And then my tree, obviously. I put the lights on it. Love it with the lights. I would just leave it like that. I showed you guys the lights, actually. I hung um, Archie's stocking up here. It's so freaking cute. And then I've just put all of um, the decorations under there until we can decorate it. The couch is there. Um, and then over here... I've just popped Archie's Bumbo under there because it's the easiest place to put it. And then we've got my little Christmas tray that I usually keep chocolates on, but all the chocolates are gone. Um, and my first snow candle. This is from Bath and Body, uh, not Bath and Body Works. Um, Where's this from? TK Maxx. And it smells so good. I actually want to light that. And then we've got Pippa's Tower over here. You love it? Do you like it? You look super comfy up there. Um, but we've got all of our little toys down here too. To They're so cute. I got these from Kmart. They're like little dumplings and pork buns. We've got some soy sauce over here. Some wasabi. I mean, she doesn't really play with them, but they're cute. I don't know what this is. I think this is the pork bun. I don't know. Maybe the other one's a bow bun. I don't know. But yeah, cute. So yeah, that is what my lounge looks like now. It just looks super cozy. I want to get a couple of Christmas cushions, but... I found some at TK Maxx and then I decided, I always do this, I thought, you know what, I'm going to go have a look at another couple of stores and if I want those ones, I'll go back. Well, I wanted those ones and I went back and they didn't have them. They would have been perfect for here, but 
that's all right I need to take the covers off the um couch at some point and get them nice and clean chuck them in the washing machine I don't know what I was thinking buying a light colored couch with the new baby people warned me but I was like no it's gonna be fine I probably have to clean them like every couple of weeks I would say but that's okay have you done are you finished with your lunch it's all on the floor did you not like your toast you didn't like the toast you just like potatoes you just like potatoes you gotta try new foods dude okay <laughs> yeah but that is my cozy little lounge for christmas i'm so excited to show a lot i was gonna send him a photo but um yeah i've got a few more places i need to tackle like over there i just need to tidy that up the kitchen is a whole nother story it's so messy now but it's just gonna have to do i just have to organize his toys over here i think i want to put all of his books on here and then i'm um, just save like a couple of books for on there i don't know what I'm going to do, but yeah, um, and just organize all of this. I don't know where all these gray boxes has got, have gone. There's one there, but I have no idea where they've all gone. There were six of them, and now I can only find three. I don't know. They'll probably be in different rooms in the house, but yeah. I love when the Christmas tree goes up in December, or before, whenever the Christmas tree goes up. I love it when it goes up, because it's just like, makes a home cozy, I personally think. So yeah, anyway, I'm going to go. I'll leave you here. Actually, you know what? I think I'm going to end this vlog here because I do have um, some editing that I need to do. I need to edit this video, this vlog for um, to get up today. I would like to get it up this afternoon. So I think I'm going to end this vlog here. This is the last vlog of 2020. And in all honesty, as 2021 gets closer and closer, I'm getting more excited. This year has been like, I mean, this year was the best year for us. We gave birth to our son. I gave birth to our son. Archie's now with us. It was the best year for us, but it's also been like a really crappy year as well. So as it gets closer and closer, I'm so excited and I hope 2021 just brings so much better energy this year. It's just yeah. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. If you watched till the end, if you watched it all, um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and like this video. It would really help me out and I will see you all in vlogmas day one in a couple of days i'm gonna upload them why i don't know why i put two fingers up um i'm gonna upload them the day after so i'll film vlogmas day one on tuesday because that's the first and then it'll be up the next day so yeah i just don't have time to um edit it uh film it that day and edit it as well i think i'd just run myself go absolutely crazy so but anyway i will see you guys then bye